Okie dokie, if you can't walk very far or you're tired, you know what you can do? You can ride a velo taxi through Frankfurt. So we're gonna do a half hour sightseeing tour and the velo taxi. This is so fun. I've ridden one of these for a short time, um, but not for a long time. So we're going past the Hauptbacke. Now normally the velo taxi driver would give you a tour and tell you what you're looking at. Today it's me. Hello, Hopvaka. And over here, the Katarina Kirsha. It's a beautiful sunny day in Frankfurt. I think the rates for this are pretty good. You get a half hour tour for 26 euros. They also will take you from A to B. So you want to uh, just ride to the Hoppenhof. Your hotel is down here and you don't feel like carrying your suitcases. Now, obviously you can't take lots of suitcases, but if you just have one, a real low taxi driver will take you to the train station. He also speaks Spanish and German. Need English books? Who can do will have them all and they will order them for you. No need to order on Amazon. This is the Goetheplatz. Named after Mr. Goethe down here. Bank, the tallest bank in the uh, tallest building in the EU. And where does it belong? Frankfurt. We have all the skyscrapers. So the Frescasse Fest is going on in the Frescasse, so I think that we're having to come down the Goethe Strasse, which is where you can leave a lot of money if you feel like leaving a lot of money somewhere. And look what's happening on the 8th of June to JP Morgan. 1900 like downtown will be crowded you will not get a restaurant space um yeah everything's gonna be packed i think the hotels are gonna be full too this is the biggest jp morgan i think usually they get about 50,000 people for this i really like riding these around you just want to rest your feet for a little bit and just see a little bit of Frankfurt. These are perfect. And these are all self-employed guys and women. Um, so if you ride around, give them a tip. All oh, the jewelry store. What do we got? Chanel over here. Yves Saint Laurent. Prada. I usually can see pretty nice cars down here too. Cartier, Bulgari, Chopard. Oh gosh, there's Dior. Look at everybody lined up, waiting to give their money out. Oh, Versace over here. Burberry. Bogner, Frida, Remova. That's that's their suitcase, aren't they? Yeah. Hermes, Jimmy Shu, and over here is the Jazz Keller. If you like jazz, this is a place to be, right over there in that little um, doorway. Michael Kors. So the Goethe Strasse is basically the Rodeo Drive of Frankfurt. Liebeskind and Jill Sander. Gibson Beach Club is set up over here. Place to go in the evenings, sand and stuff. And now we have the old opera house. Go out here, earn money, blow them, lots of bubbles. So the old opera house was built in 1880. 
always a busy place for everybody to come. It's beautiful at night time too once the lights go on and all these buildings down here the lights come on and they don't use it for opera anymore it's just um they do concerts here and balls and things like that and we're on the ball and Laga, so where those trees are that goes straight down to the river it's where our city wall used to be some pretty high class restaurants down along here once COVID came, they all expanded. They used to not have so many tables outside. So the old opera house is just beautiful, nice white soft sand, uh, limestone with beautiful lanterns. If you were here in the springtime, these are cherry trees. And they were all in bloom. It was really pretty. I just love the lanterns down here. I just think they're gorgeous. Mm. Well, we're having to take a different way out of here. It's a Sophie Tell right here. Beautiful five-star hotel. With a rooftop bar. So we're in the Wall Anlaga, or Wall Anlaga. This is where our city wall once stood. The city wall was built in the, um, between the 13 and 1400s. And then the French got here and we just made us tear our wall down. We made it into a beautiful park. So when you come walking in here, you can feel uh, the temperature drop. Lots of geese down here. Oh, look at the heron over there. He's fishing. He's usually down here. And the uh, Nile geese are usually down here with their babies. There's some geese across on the other side of the pond swimming with their babies. It's a great piece of nature right in the middle of Frankfurt City. It surrounds the whole city center. I'm glad we got to see the heron. And this is the Hilton coming up on our right. And if you've ever seen those funny looking trees all over Frankfurt, those are plantonin trees. And these trees here are the same ones, just that they're not pruned. Yeah, the Hilton has the best backyard in all of Frankfurt. And if you have breakfast there, you can come out there on that patio. It's a little garden house. We should have art exhibits in there. It kind of looks like it's closed for right now. Hi! <laughs> I like waving to the Velo taxis too. <laughs> These are ginkgo trees right here. Planted in a little park in the shape of a ginkgo leaf. red building over there is a movie theater so if you're looking for something to do at nighttime if it's raining or something that's where you can go this is the U-Bahn uh, Eschenheimer Tour this is the U1 U2 U3 and U8 come through here Fleming's Hotel is right there with the Eschenheimer Tour. So this used to be the gate into the city. It was built around 1425, 1428 by our city architect, Madron Gertner. And it has survived 
everything, including World War II. It has survived mayors wanting to tear it down. As I said, it impedes traffic, and it does, but who cares? It's a lovely piece of old architecture sitting in the middle of the city. And they have a great cafe. I like to sit here and just people watch. So this is the Schillerstrasse and on Friday they have a huge farmer's market along here. The rest of the time is nice stores, cheese. Uh, this is new over here, Hawaiian Poke Bowl. Got a reform house over here. We've got some coffee and bagels and the cow that laughs, burgers. Second hand store. These stores have changed. Closed down. I don't know if it's because of COVID or just because it was a time to move. This is the Chamber of Commerce for Frankfurt. You want to go in business for yourself, that's where you need to go. They can help you with licensing. Sushi Circle. And we're coming up on the Bull and the Bear. the Frankfurt Stock Exchange. And of course, Starbucks. So there's often lots of people over here taking their photo with the bull and the bear. So which one would you rather take your photo with? The bull with the shiny horns or the bear with the shiny ears and nose? Stock exchange there, the docks. These statues are up here interesting, so come up here and take take a look at them. They're all the continents. Americas, Africa, Australia, Europe, and this guy over here for land trade. If you're on a private tour with us, we'll be glad to take you over here and show those to you a little bit closer. more information about the Velo Taxis once this goes um, on YouTube, but this is their information. I'll take one of these with me and uh, then we can all know more about them. So when you come to Frankfurt, you can ride in a Velo Taxi too. What's really fun is sometimes when they have um, a wedding and all the wedding party gets in a Velo Taxi and the Velo Taxis are all decorated with ribbons and flowers and things. So that's the Fresca, so that's the Fresca Fest. We have a, a video for that. There's the Gerda Platz again. I guess technically they're supposed to ride on the areas where the bicycles can ride. There's Hugo Droop on the other side. That's a, a nice view. 
you the Katarina kiosk. Well, they did mat organ matinees in there on Mondays and Thursdays at 4.30. Look what a beautiful sky we've got today. I see not only another Velo taxi, but a rickshaw. How fun is that? Bye! <laughs> so we're on the Zile right now. This is our pedestrian shopping zone. You go on past Galleria. This is a big department store with a nice restaurant up on the roof. It's a good place to get a view of the city for free. Eh, you get a beer, a glass of wine, or water and go out there. People are always out here singing or making music. Watch out. This is called Noya Kramer. If you're coming to our tour and you've gotten off at the s bahn at the Hauptwache, this is the street you'd be walking down. Walking past the yogurt and the closed Burger King. This is the back street for the Liebfrauen Church. The Christmas market comes down through here. This is the Leapfrauen Church. They do breakfast here uh, Monday through Saturday for 50 cents for those less fortunate. Nice breakfast. And this is the Leapfrauen Berg. So back in there with the orange awnings is the Klein Martala. So. They have little festivals here. We just had one here this past weekend. May, the May Fest and wine. It's a good butcher over here. They've got really good green sauce here at Heininger. I go there quite often. Kirsha over here, this big round red building. This is where they held the first freely elected parliament in 1848. It's also where John F. Kennedy came in June of 1963. They, today they use it for all kinds of stuff. Like when the president, what Angel America would come to Frankfurt, that's where she would be. Dalai Lama, Queen Elizabeth. Well, giving speeches. This is called the Paul's Bus. This is where everybody comes and sits and drinks coffee and has ice cream, spaghetti ice. John F. Kennedy right there. Uh -uh. Call this the Paz Kirsch, the cradle of German democracy. And it was. There's the Rotz Keller over there. This is all part of the uh, city hall. We have 11 buildings all together. And that little bridge over here is called the Bridge of Size you would come into City Hall on that side and walk across and pay your taxes and you would oh, sigh. The Christmas market is down here, of course. It's all over the, the city, down through here. Now 
have a tram stop here, the 11, the 12, and the 14. And right here is where you would wait for us. This is where our tour starts, right? Where this bending shit pub is. team just came a couple weeks ago when they won the European Championships. And here's our Fountain of Justice, Desizia, and the Alta Nicolai Church. The river is down to there. I think we're going to go up here and see where our Velo taxi is going. Places to have a drink. Yay, we go through our new old town. just rebuilt. Um, they reopened this up in 2018. We have 15 reconstructed houses that look just like they used to and 20 that are sort of in the style of. Oh, he's going back in here. <laughs> all uh, hand done wood and stone slate work you can have an apartment back here you got some money look at this woodwork then the Struffel Pater Museum Pretty nice restaurant here, but it's pricey. Uh, we've got Steif over here. Those original German stuffed animals. Pharmacy. So this is pretty lively, especially in the evenings. Saturdays, Sundays. This place here, Top Fry Bauer, they have beautiful things in there and it's been in business since 1575. We're coming up on the Gold Navaga. This is the most beautiful house here in the in the new old town. The city spent a fortune reconstructing it. And they got luscious desserts. And then back in there is Francona Ford. That's our archaeology. And there's the Kaiser Dome. This is where the emperors were elected and crowned. Oh. If you've got, uh, if you're feeling really fit, you can climb up to the top of the steeple. It's only 323 steps. Nice view of the old town and the Golden Navaga, Golden Scales. It's the Shear Museum down here. If you want to climb to the top of the steeple, that's the entrance right there. Museum, which 
This used to be the Leinwand house. This is a house built for the linen merchants to store their cloth as they wanted a stone house. Nice view of the dome. It's a Salgasa. right on the river. I'll tell you what, for 30 minutes, this guy is going to show you a lot of Frankfurt. That's the Altebrucker Old Bridge. And this is the Mine River. This runs into the Rhine. And you got these little tour boats. And the other side of the river is called Sachsenhausen. I'm going to leave you the phone number for this guy too. So if you just want him to come and pick you up at your hotel, it's down here in the city center. I think that he will. If they have an event. I know sometimes a lot of velo taxis will get together. Someone's arranged for them to come and take a whole group of people somewhere. So all the museums are all along the river there where, where the trees are, Sachsenhausen. This is the historical museum here. I hear bells ringing. It usually means there's an, the steam train is coming down through here. They really don't want to get out of the way. So the historical museum is, is huge. It's 6,000 square meters of everything about Frankfurt. If you want some good desserts, that's the place to go here at House of Air Time. stuffed animals over there. Teddy Paradise. And the back of the Alta Nikolai. We're back at the Romer. That's it. Thank you so much. Would you like to say anything? Please? Do you want to say anything? Uh, that's it. So 30 minute tour without <laughs> telling something for me. <laughs> Otherwise, we have to take a longer time. For okay. <laughs> Thank you so much. And uh, we'll see you on YouTube.